Um, and what he did is that the existing uh, codices that the companions of Muhammad possessed, that he forced them from their holders, and then he burned them. Okay, or in other tradition, he, you know, uh, he was he he tore them apart, uh, but he burned them, and then so that uh, there were only one version would survive. Okay, which is the version that we have right now. So this, despite this fact, we do have uh, there are you know a companion Ibn Masoud who refused to uh, give his own codex, his own copy, uh, to burn it, and then he kept it. And we do know that even a hundred years later, or probably even more, in, in Iraq, uh, that they were still reciting using this codex or this version of Ibn Masoud. And then it slowly died down, you know, after second century, it's like eighth century, mid, mid, you know, probably after the 800s, it started to die down. But many of the particulars of these readings were recorded in sources 